Hey, what's up? Dragon here again. Today I'm going to be focusing just on my Twitch recap. If you hadn't seen my YouTube recap of the entire last year, I would suggest you check out the previous video. Because today we're going to focus solely on Twitch and start wrapping up the year of the nostalgia months. And really just kind of the year in general, but you know. I, I, I phrased that wrong. So. Let me look at this right here. So, this is my annual recap. We're going to check the one for our creator this time. Similar to the, the studio version on YouTube, but this is just my annual recap for Twitch. I'm going to skip all this. Am I even going to pay attention to the six viewers don't even pay attention to the 435 chat sent because most of that might be very useful for you guys but I do kind of want to cover these top five categories because I thought they were pretty cool and kind of lead into some of my personal ones that I want to do this year for next year so about at the bottom of the list is going to be portal 2 I did play some Portal 2 and played through the entirety of Portal 2. Uh, that was supposed to be uh, this year as well, but I uh, messed with it. My bad. Then we did we did a regular Portal. Right, uh, that I guess that's uh, five and then four. Minecraft is basically a mainstay on the boat. I when I was doing most of my streams on this. I was streaming a lot of Minecraft early on before I decided to hop on some of the other games. And early on in the year, we decided to do some more Bendy and the Dark Revival. I was actually supposed to show when the game dropped, but uh, things happened. So I, we didn't get to do that until early this year. So that's what's the price of summer two. Then, number one is a pretty recent one for the channel. Which, or the Twitch channel, because we just got this finished, and I actually kind of like it. Uh, this roughly, we didn't even finish it yet when this first came out. So, the top 10% of Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. I thought about playing that this year for Nostalgia Month, but that has a curse word in it, like, every 30 seconds. And I wish that's an exaggeration. It's probably even worse than that. It's not, it's not bad enough, but, uh, the boss fights don't help in my case there. My top three tags. Base Cam, North America, and USA. And did a lot of rating of 14 and shadows or 19 or 9. Which actually isn't that terrible great job for that models we did. Out of when I first started it was about twenty five followers. On Twitch, yeah, as of the time of the recap, 25 new followers have joined the Dragon's Den over here. And I probably need to do a different thing there. But if I go to my channel and I'm going to mute that. We currently, as of this recording, have 60 followers over there. So, uh, I want to thank you guys for the 448 over here on the YouTube channel. And I want to thank you guys for 60 followers over here on Twitch as well. I really appreciate it. And this is a little bit of a note. Boom. That we have a Nightbot. But we also have oh I didn't even type in the chat doink 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 YouTube the stream labs and I bought are now in my YouTube chat and my Twitch chat as well just a secondary moderation bot as well so all right now that we've talked about how we've shown up this year and I, I kind of want to talk about some things that I want to do 
this upcoming year. I would like to hit affiliate. It's going to be a tough road, but I think you can do it. Over on the other YouTube channel, I, for other video, I want to talk about on there. I think I may have brought one point, but I want to hit 500 subscribers. I want to hit that by this time next year. And I think we did. Make a couple of changes to the YouTube content. Do a lot more live streams. I think it, I think it can happen. Here, I want to hit affiliate. So, get a lot more or a very consistent schedule over there, over here on the YouTube, and over there on Twitch. And I think I, I can hit both of those goals. That also has a viewer restriction. But as long as I can hit the threshold, it should work on that part as well. And there, I want to try branching out and getting a lot more games on free YouTube. It's not going to be as easy, but over there, sorry, uh, over there, I can kind of branch over what do whatever games Twitch will allow me to. You know, I don't have to put do more self some restrictions over there. I was thinking about maybe uh, going back to Dark Revival over there on Twitch as well. I'll probably do that closer to Bendy's anniversary, um, but. Um, as far as other goals, it's just going to be try to do, kind of finish up what I've got and uh, maybe tr play a couple Final Fantasy or Security Breach. And I don't have a VR, so I can't play Help One or Help One Two as much as I want to play those two. And, uh, I think this is pretty much where that. Goals and it's mainly just kind of hitting play it and streaming there a lot more as well. I'll probably try gain a couple of other moderators over there as well. That honestly shouldn't be that hard to do, but I won't be a little bit more strict on the moderators. I just kind of hit one because I need one. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna be recording this. Jeez. And, uh, you will see that moderation bot I brought up over on here as well. But I just kind of want to show it on the Twitch side as well. Uh, is there anything else I want to add? Uh, not that I personally know of. I'll probably add something in the comment section or in the merge app. But I don't think it's going to be that big of a notice. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I want to thank you guys for an incredible year on both YouTube and Twitch, and I shall see you guys over there next year, and on the next stream and video and whatnot. Now, we just got just some winding downs and playing for next year, so I will probably do a next one, it'll be more kind of a that's, I'd say it's probably going to be another retrospective, but it's not going to be as retrospective -y as these other two have been. I think it's going to be more kind of, I wouldn't say more content creation focused, but I want to kind of reflect on what I've done this past year. Just in general and how the last year went. And then I'm going to take the last year of like content creators I found and put them in one separate video as well. And uh, that might just be an extra video you know, actually. Um, I'm not recording that back to back as I've been doing these. But that might remind me about that because I'm, sure, I'm sure I'll forget. And uh, I'll see you guys then, I guess.